Welcome to Mike Golden Games and welcome back to Forza Horizon 4. In this episode, we're going to be taking the Aston Martin DB5 around Edinburgh. This episode was subscriber requested by Scottish2018. So I just want to thank him for, you know, giving me this request. So basically, we're just going to take the DB5 around Edinburgh, drive it around there, you know, look in the sights. And I actually did some modifications to this thing. Uh, all wheel drive, so it handles a lot better. It's got an upgraded engine as well. I swapped it out for a better V8 engine. So, and I also got the snow tires on this thing because it is the winter right now. And as you can see, it's snowing. So let's go in first person just to see what that looks like. Man, this car is freaking sick. Oh, that was a close one. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, Ooh, that was a close one. Regained it, I got control again. But so yeah, like I said, we're gonna drive around Edinburgh and then we're going to do a race. I believe it's a street race uh, in this car. And then we'll see where the episode goes. But either way, I hope you guys will enjoy this episode. If you do enjoy it, hit that like button. It really does help me out when you guys do that. Let me know in the comments below if you guys have any suggestions for other things you want me to do in this game. Let's get over to Edinburgh. It's a bit of a drive. It's about three miles away. So I'll see you when we get there. All right, guys, we are getting into Edinburgh now. So we're just going to drive around here, see what we can find. There's actually a house that you can buy here, Edinburgh Castle. Uh, it's $15 million. Now, you're not actually technically buying the castle. It, it said you when you buy it, you are actually just become a patron of it. So you do have to actually keep it open fully to the public. Basically, you're just, you know, donating money, and it lets you live inside it. It's pretty cool, though. It is pretty cool. I don't have that kind of money right now. So I'll, we'll take a left here. I'm going to turn my GPS off. So just turn my GPS off, and we're just going to drive around the city here. We'll do some drifts and whatnot. Again, this is all-wheel drive now. You know, I feel like James Bond cars would be all-wheel drive because, you know, you never know when he's going to have to go off-road. All right, guys, there is Edinburgh Castle up there. I suppose we can drive up there and see what it looks like. Um, we'll take a left here. Yeah, we gotta find our way up there. Looks like there's some trails and stuff around here that we can take, but... Uh, let's see, we'll keep going down. Ooh, we got a picture spot right here. Let's check it out. Scott Monument. Ooh, man, that is beautiful. Welcome to Edinburgh. Greatest city in the world. <laughs> Grab Look at my guy Flossum. <laughs> some salt and sauce and make yourself at home. Oh, that DB5 looks freaking beautiful. All right, let's uh, stop flossing here and get back inside the Aston. It's a little cold out. It was like 31 degrees, I think it said. Let's see, does this car have any kind of gauges that I can look at? Uh, the other thing, the fuel gauge actually does work. I don't know if you can actually run out of fuel or not, but when I was messing around in the Ford Raptor doing some off-roading in the snow, the fuel gauge actually started to go down, so that's really cool. Um, and then some of the cars have like a digital thermostat or you know like temperature gauge and uh yeah it actually changes the weather and everything like you can actually use it like in real life so you know the small details in this game are really awesome uh let's see we'll take a right up here hey man where are you going this car is going slow i'm gonna get around them Ooh, listen to that engine I forgot to turn the radio off because even though I have streamer mode enabled, I got a copyright claim, which, you know, it was fine, and I just removed the song either way. But, yeah, it's supposed to be streamer mode so you don't get copyrights. And, uh, yeah, it happened anyways. Uh, so we're going to take a left up here. I wonder if we can get in there. I don't think so. But this is a beautiful city, though. I'm going to take a left here. Watch out for that taxi. Whoop. Oh. Yeah. What is this guy doing? You're on the wrong side of the road, Mercedes. What are you doing, dude? Is anybody even in there? I can't even see in there. It's got really dark tint. All right, so anyways, let's make our way up to Edinburgh Castle, and then we'll go do that street race. Whoop, up, up, we'll go uh, off-road. There we go. One thing I would like to see, the TARDIS, anybody? Ah, ah, yeah, I, I think that would be odd. Uh, that said no entrance. Anyways, here is Edinburgh Castle. Man, that would be sick to go to. You know, if I ever went there, 
you know, you can take tours, I guess. But let's see what it looks like. Ooh, man. That is beautiful. So you would unlock an Alfa Romeo P3 and 10 super wheel spins. Cost 15 million credits, though. That's a lot. Okay, so let's back out here. We're going to go do that street race now. Uh, we're going to flip a bitch. Oh! Yeah, see, that, that's the one thing with all-wheel drive. You can't really make a great flip a bitch unless you're going pretty quick, and then you just, uh, you know, flip it around. But anyways, let's get up here. It looks like there is... I don't know. It looks like there's, like, the breakable boards and stuff, but they're up on top of the buildings. So I have no idea how you're supposed to get up there. Ooh, look at that statue. Nice. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Got to keep it on the road. Keep it on the road. For those of you that don't know what the TARDIS is, it's basically one of these phone booths, except uh, old, more old-timey, and it's blue. It's a police telephone box, and uh, it's, it's a time machine. You know, Doctor Who and all that good stuff. Man, I haven't watched Doctor Who in a few years. I used to watch it every single time it came on, but... Yeah, I don't know. After David Tennant, I wasn't really too into uh, uh, Matt Smith. Like, I, I watched all his episodes, but wasn't too into him. They were a little more serious, too. It wasn't too much comedy, where, you know, David Tennant, he was hilarious. He was a great doctor. Anyways, there's now a new doctor. I think it's a female doctor. Have not, uh, have not watched any of the new episodes with the female doctor. And then the one before the current one, I saw, I think, most of those episodes. Anyways, we're not here to talk about Doctor Who. We're here to do some street racing and patrol around Edinburgh, so let's get... Oh, 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 nobody saw that. Nobody saw that. Anyways, here we go. We got the street race right up here. Oh, man, that Aston is beautiful. Edinburgh Stock Bridge. Street race. Okay, uh, we will just start the race right now. We're racing against the Porsche Ferraris. Oh, man. Okay, I'm just going to gun it. Hey, guys, come through. James Bond coming through. Yep. Oh, what the... Okay, I gotta be a little more careful there. Again, I have the super realistic damage on, so if I crash... Oh! Okay. I'm gonna have to rewind it there. See, when I'm talking, I'm not paying attention, and I should have clearly saw there was a huge turn coming up here. Come on, baby, come on. And again, I have snow tires on, so I should be doing pretty good. I don't know if we're gonna be going out in the snow, though. Oh! Okay, come on now. I am really humiliating my face itself right now. Oh, oh, come on, come on. Come on, DB5, you got this, baby. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -da. All right, I'm just gonna try and focus on the race. Let's get around these cars here. Okay, this car is freaking slidey. I mean, I get it, it's snowing out. I have snow tires on. Break, 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 break. Come on, ow. Come on, come on, get around there, get around there. Let's go gun it. Okay, okay, here we go. I'm in sixth place right now. I think that's the first car right up there. Come on, come on, come on, come on. And now that's the other thing, because it is all-wheel drive. I don't have the best turning radius, so that might be what's hurting me as well. I may be able to do some tuning to fix that. But, oh, shoot, what the heck was that? Okay, come on, come on, there we go, and slow it down, slow it down. Come on, come on, come on, go! Come on! Is that the finish line? No, that's a checkpoint. Come on, there we go, a little drift around there. Come on, baby, come on. And we'll slam on the brakes and gun it, come on. We're doing all right, we're doing all right. Come on, get around there and finish line. Come on, baby. Now we can really open it up. 185. Whew. Man, a DB5 going 185 miles an hour. That is freaking quick. We're racing modern cars, too. A Hoonigan Porsche, a McLaren 570S, Ferrari 599 GTO. Like, we are racing modern cars, and I'm racing a car from freaking 1964. Okay. And we came out two seconds ahead, too. All right. Beautiful. Yeah. 
Okay, it's a little a little disappointing with no music playing. Fourteen thousand two hundred and sixty-seven dollars. Not bad. And got four thousand influence. Nice. Oh, nice. Leveled up. Street scene round three. Running man challenge emote unlocked. Oh, a Skyline GTR. <sighs> Beautiful. That's the next car we're going to unlock, it looks like. Qualified for spring. Okay, sweet. Ooh, got some muddy roads and stuff. Hey, Mike. Congratulations. You've made it through to the spring season. Meet me at the festival. Our team will get you set up. Okay, guys, so I'm going to leave this episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And Scottish 2018, I hope you enjoyed it as well. And if anybody has any suggestions for other things you guys want to see, let me know in the comments below, and I will try to do them for you. All right, guys, take it easy. Hit that like button, and maybe consider subscribing if you haven't already. Have a great day, guys.